Hey yo, what's going on guys? It's JC again, back with a brand new video. Today, we are going to be doing a tutorial about the creeper farm. As to get started, we are going to be looking at the supplies. So, for supplies, we have four concrete, four stacks of concrete. I'm using concrete, you can use any type of block. Signs, uh, hoppers, glass, chest, one bucket of lava, two buckets of water, two cats if you're doing this in survival, good luck finding some cats. You can use the um, iron farm uh, that I sh uh, showcased and uh, did a tutorial about last video no two videos ago cats can also spawn around the iron farm so you can get your cats from there if you built it R any type of fish to breed the cats need some carpet and two stacks of chopped doors so let's get this stuff so let's take a quick look at what we are building today so this is the creeper farm it's very small very simple very efficient so as to get started we're going to be building this main creeper spawner first then after building the killer section to kill the creepers and then the afk section because this is a afk farm so how it works is you can't really see much let me just get a potion of night vision right there so we can now see better um how it works is there's cats here creepers scared of cats so the cats once you breathe with them you make them sit and put them here Creepers will spawn, just creepers will spawn. Be scared of the cats, run into here. They'll think the chapters are a full block. They'll fall down, they'll be pushed with the water into the lava, die, and then their gunpowder will fall into the hoppers, into the chest, and then there you go. Now, there's two versions of this this one that we are going to be building or this version this version doesn't not only give you gunpowder but XP so basically what it what the difference is the water stream works but the killing section instead of lava you will make the creepers fall down like here then you kill them with a the sword their gunpowder will fall into there and you get XP as well so we'll build, I'll just show you how to build this one later. Now, let's get started with the build, shall we? Let's get some blocks. Now, to get started, you want to find a 13 by 16 area. And come to the side, build 5 blocks, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Build across 16 blocks, 1, 2, 3, 4 two blocks in the center build a 2x2 two two platform right here break these three center blocks then we want to repeat on the other side one two three four come out to here bang bang right. like so then I'm going to be Removing the rain because it's very annoying. Then you want to bring up the walls too high. They don't stop. So after you have built this section, that's what you're supposed to look. How they're looking like. You want to then get your trapdoors. 
find the center block, find the top block here, put the trap door right there. That's where you're gonna put your cat. Then for the roof, you just wanna basically cover the entire roof with trap doors. You would only just shift and then place the trap doors on each other. So you basically you just want to get all your trap doors and put them on the roof so then just creepers spawn because uh, creepers fit in between um, your trap doors even uh, if you perfectly fit so you want to copy this on the other side now so after you have put your trap doors down you then want to get your pet cat breathe it make it sit and then push it slowly right onto there do this on both sides so breathe the cat thank you and uh, push it right into there then you want to for lighting because if I take the night vision off in there would still be very bright because the trap doors don't block off light so what you want to do is cover the entire ceiling with just the same block quick reminder the block is optional so you want to do this on both sides so after you have built your roof that is the main spawner built so then you want to jump into here I do recommend you just light up the area until we finish off here uh, so no mob spawn so no creepers spawn then you want to get your carpets go next to the trap door so two blocks trap door two blocks trap door two blocks in front two blocks there two blocks there okay do it on the same side so this is 100% symmetrical there we go finished I'm gonna come out block that off and then there then you have to come underneath normally uh, under here you'd have to dig it out but I'm gonna have to build it up so just basically you would you would dig down two blocks downwards right here so you would come into these three three by two area dig down so there's two blocks from underneath the trap doors and then you would keep building our uh, uh, breaking blocks until if you get a water stream right there so right there then what you want to do is break those two blocks and then keep building to how far the water goes for us it's still over here and then we'll come to the end and just put away the rain the thunder we don't have a bunch of distraction and we'll get your signs, hoppers, buckets, chest, and glass so we come here, put a sign there, there, put it on the same side like so okay, glass and put it right there like so then you can also put your glass on top so when you're AFK up on that pillar you can see that um, 
your farm is working or not. Most likely it will. I'll put your two bucks of lava right there, so that's how the creepers will be killed. And to break down this area here, come right about here, oh, right here, pure chest, right there. Come to here, carefully put your hoppers there, so when the creepers will spawn down, they will flow into here, burn up, and their items will fall into there. Now you can simply extend the chest by doing something a little bit like that. Then it will be extended. And then that's your that's your choice from there. And that is the creeper farm built. Now for the for to AFK the farm since uh, you can't like stay right here and they'll um, spawn and get a couple of blocks and build up approximately 80 blocks higher than the farm so after you've built up 80 blocks high then from here it's your choice what to do I'm just gonna do this so then you have a little platform uh, just to sit here and you can be AFK as long as you want with this farm that one you kinda can't because you have to go kill them but with this one you can stay as long as you want so you can basically build the tower any design you want so you can use a ladder to go up you can use a water elevator you can use a redstone elevator, your choice. Then up here, whatever you want, as long as you have a platform to stay. And you're standing 80 blocks higher than the roof. And then that right there is the farm built. Now, there's the this second way to build it. To like to get XP from it as well. If I were you, I'd build this. But this is the original version to do it. This is the original. If you want to say AFK as long as you want, this is the original way to do it. But if you want XP to add on to do on on it, you basically you'd build the water normally. Then on the last block, you would break those two blocks and replace them with trapdoors and flip them down. And you would my another the two blocks in front of it, put the trap doors there so then when the creepers come down they will fall into this pit. Now this can be as deep as you want it to be as long as the creepers don't die from fall damage then this can be as deep as you want. Then when you found the floor where you want it where you want the uh, chest to be you would mine a 2x2 two two, put two chests there put four hops above it that same block this block right here you would then replace it with slabs all around the edge so you can kill them let me just demonstrate if I get creepers now let's say all these creepers spawned in from the farm. You would wait up there. You do the glass as well. So for example they'll fall into there. And then it will be like right there where they fall and then they go down. This guy go lucky but you would normally just block off this area as well. They'd fall here, then you start smacking them. To get XP and their gunpowder, and also if you have mending on your tools, this will be a good choice for an XP farm as well. So you can see gunpowder 
It goes into these two chests. And uh, you get your XP by picking it up. Now, quick advice man, with this, don't stand too close to it. And this should also be slabs around here, so you don't have to keep shifting. It also builds the surrounding area with obsidian, just in case of explosions. But be 100% explosion proof I suggest when you're killing them you stay about a block away from the chest so if you're killing them from here they will see you and start to explode if you do hear the explosion just run that's all you can do if they explode that's your problem not mine so um, yeah that is the creeper farm tutorial 100% built you can use it to uh, make fire rockets and sand one of the two most important things to me in survival minecraft so that's why I did a tutorial of this creeper farm anyways hope you enjoyed the video hope this helps you all out if you have a survival world and I'll catch you guys in the next video see ya